hello guys how are you guys doing today and happy sunday to you all just like i've said before so guys there is something that i want to tell you guys i know it has been happening it has been happening it has been happening since i moved into this new apartment but i want to really make it official now you know i want to officially tell you guys that right now i won't be able to be posting videos every day like i used to i've been wanting to tell you guys this for a very long time but i don't have i didn't have the chance the opportunity to tell you guys but i decided to say it now in this video so tomorrow will be my first day at work like in my new place that i am planning to learn a skill so i will i won't be having much time like much chance because this work that I want to learn now, this sewing, it needs, it requires enough dedication and concentration and you know, so I won't have the chance to be, you know, filming and editing videos every day like I used to and be uploading videos every day like I used to. But I, I promise to try my best to make sure that three times in a week, by God's grace, three times in a week that I put, I upload video and see you guys, okay? So you guys don't have to worry because you guys are still in my heart and I love you guys so much, okay? So this is to the true lovers of Juliet Uju. I know some people will be like, oh, no, that is your business. But I know that you guys love me, okay? So that is why I want to make this official to you guys. I apologize for these things that i have said now because i know that most of you know that i used to upload videos every day but i just hope you guys will understand that it's no longer possible now because you know as i have moved into my new apartment many things are beginning to change in my life for example when i was in the village i don't work i don't you know do i only do house chores you know but right now I am combining so many things I am thinking of you know getting a life for myself which is supposed you know getting something to do with my life and that is what I am doing now so I hope you guys will understand that <sighs> so guys and it's also difficult for me you know because I'm used to uploading videos every day but I hope all of us will understand and adapt to the new changes please guys so tomorrow will be my first day at work so i am planning you know i have to prepare the food today because i'll be carrying my food cooking my food and carrying it myself
so just finished eating now and i'm about to prepare the stew these are the things that i bought yesterday i bought all this both the tomatoes the fish and everything yesterday and i used the other fish that i bought to prepare um soup yesterday so now i want to you know use the remaining fish to prepare this stew so since i don't have I don't have um, mortar and you know grinding uh, all this manual grinder or something like that or even blender so I am going to be using what um, this tongari to pound the tomatoes so I use it to pound these tomatoes you know I'm not going to be adding uh, ordinary tomato like thin tomato to this to this stew so just fresh tomato stew that i'm going to be uh, cooking so i'll use the pound the tongari to pound it then anyhow it pounds i don't i don't need it to pound finish just to pound it small since there is nothing to use and pound it so and then i'll prepare it like that so now i've started preparing the stew so as you all know i don't fry yeah i don't fry i only cook my stew like that natural I don't fry anything in my stew because I've had it many times I mentioned it in the other video that they said that frying is not good for the health you know some people may think otherwise but I like to take that I prefer to you know cook my stew the way they are just cook it natural and that is why I don't add thin tomato because thin tomato will be making making it to have Sour taste, you know, if you don't fry it, thin tomato will make it to have some sour taste. But this fresh tomato, if you cook it, add plenty of uh, onions and add fish, add other things that you want to add, both meat and uh, for those that can add meat. So, if you add all those things, the sour taste will disappear, it won't have any sour taste. At least, if even if it will have, it will not be that much, you know. So it doesn't even have because thin tomato is just you know natural you know and it's 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 sweet like it's always sweet in the mouth so that is why i cook it like that so it's possible to add more oil but i prefer to add more oil <laughs> to manage my oil you know so that is just it so very soon our stew will be ready and it will be delicious this fish i used to think that this fish is not is not good because um in Anambra state in my state i don't eat this type of fish we don't buy this type of fish you know we don't even see it like that but here i saw the fish and it's cheaper than the titus fish so i was like wow i don't like this fish or we don't we don't eat this type of fish or. she the woman was telling me ah the fish is nice you can try it so today i decided to try it i use it for that okra soup and it was very delicious i was surprised because i thought the fish is not going to be delicious so now our food is ready our rice and stew this is sunday rice and stew come and join me come and join me come and join me i started with the fish <laughs> i wanted to you know taste the fish and see how the fish tastes so and it was very delicious in fact it gave the stew a very nice taste you know so I was very happy with this stew. In fact, I enjoyed this stew. I loved it. And I said to myself, I am going to take this stew to work tomorrow. Tomorrow, tomorrow. Okay, so come and join me and eat my lunch if you want to eat. Okay. <laughs> the next day. So yeah, the long awaited day is now here and i am preparing for work my first day at work oh my goodness i wonder how it's going to be so i am packing my properties i'm going to be using my school bag to be working to be going for this work you know i want to pack all my properties you know i don't have light so i'll just pack everything inside this bag so that i'll be charging it in the shop and this is the cloth that i'll be wearing for my first day at work and i'll be eating swallow this morning because i'll be carrying the rice that i prepared yesterday to um to work so 
I'll be having the rice for lunch. That is what I'm warming now. And my hair is not good. Oh no. So I really have to tend to my hair. So I just weave it normal, normal weaving. I was supposed to make my hair. You know, I wanted to make it the other time. After packing the attachment, I did not let her go and make it again because I left that place and went to the market. But anyway, let's see how it's going to be because I, you know I'm preparing for work so i won't be having chance for the hair again so how do i look <laughs> so yeah let me put on my belt and everything you know <laughs> so how do i look i am oh oh my goodness i love the dress thing <laughs> so locking up my doors and i am ready to take some pictures for my first day at work, okay? Mota, yeah. Expensive. Ah, it's expensive. Oh. What's the price? It's yes. expensive. It's the big. How much you say your partner? One thousand. Why they come on? She they say she. She say she. Hello. Okay. I do this video. Okay, this guy you I have. swear. <laughs> do video too. <laughs> no, you don't apply pressure. No, <laughs> Hello guys, so I just closed from work so I decided to go out there and make my hair because my hair is not looking good the hair is embarrassing me and the hair is too short so I decided to go and make it so I am here now I have told them they said that they can make it so I told them to go ahead and start making it I told her the style that she should make for me but she's not actually getting the style but it's fine she, I think it's okay she's not getting it very well she's just an apprentice like me so like the style they didn't do it like this but she said that she wants the hair to last long that is why she's doing it like this so i understand her point so i left her to continue with what she's doing so she has finished making the hair and what do you guys think about the hair so she's done and i think it's you know okay it's though it's not looking like the hair that i told her to make for me or it's okay so guys, look at my hair. <laughs> so how do you guys see the hair? I just got back now and <sighs> today is my first day at work. <laughs> it was a very hectic one. <laughs> oh god have mercy the experience i had you know peddling machine for the first time <laughs> but i learned fast i learned fast even the boss he was surprised like our ogre and my colleagues they were surprised they were like juliet wow you learn so fast oh my god you know that kind of thing mm -hmm. So I was, you know, kind of shy, so to say. But I learned fast. Guys, you won't believe that today, just today, that is my first day or uh, at that um walk. I I actually sewed something. I actually sewed like no not like real so you know, you know, after they finished they taught me about three things. They taught me how to pedal the machine, how to, you know, step on the machine and control it. After that, they also taught me 
how to fix the thread that is not so that is not so difficult so it was I just learned it so and then they gave me you know pieces all these pieces just for me to run it over yeah I was able to run it over you know that kind of thing but these are the three things that I did today but um it's I was not able to get the lines straight oh, no. <laughs> getting the lines straight was so difficult for me oh Jesus help me so help you but I thank God I thank God for everything God made everything so easy for me thank you Jesus thank God seriously because I didn't believe that I can ever actually learn it one of the one of my colleagues who knows how to sew very well she has been in um into sewing for some years now according to her she said that it took her two weeks two weeks to learn how to pedal machine to control it so she was surprised that i was you know able to though it was difficult for me i it took me a very long time but finally i got got just did it for me and i was able to you know control it a little bit i'm not yet perfect though because today is my first day so, but hopefully tomorrow I will be better but guys I'm so thankful to God I'm so thankful to God seriously for everything and I am happy <sighs> so because there is no time I had to you know take permission and go and get my hair done you know I've been carrying the hair like that for a very long time and it's not good the hair is not looking good you know that kind of thing so I had to go and get a new hair a new look today look at my new look what do you think about it guys so I just got back now look at what I bought I bought some things that I, I am going to cook look at this plantain guys this plantain now is 1000 naira that this woman bought it, it gave me this plantain which means she gave me two plantain for 500 <laughs> and then this one anyway it's fine then the scent leaf this is what i will prepare and use and go to work tomorrow because i prefer to cook my own food by myself after cooking it i'll carry it to work like today i i uh, took some of the rice that I prepared the other time So guys, I am not going to eat the rice again today. No, 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 I can't So the two cups of rice, it's just two cups of rice that I prepared since Sunday But it's still remaining. I still took it to work. It's still remaining <laughs> So I will not eat it today. I will keep it tomorrow morning I will eat it before going to work. Then I'll carry this plantain as my lunch then I'm going to eat swallow because the soup I prepared since Saturday is still remaining. Very small soup, but I've not been able to finish it. So, so I'm just you know kind of eating, but I'm I'm eating. You know, I do eat very well, but you know, being alone, I don't usually finish the food easily like that. So, I just eat the ones I can eat and then keep the one, keep the remaining one. So enough talking, let's go to the kitchen because I have so many things to do. I have to bathe, I have to pray, I have to, you know, um, eat, I have to warm the food that is, uh, that is still here. So enough talking. So 
I just finished bathing now and I want to take hot tea, okay? This is what I want to eat for this night. Thank you so much for watching guys and I'll see you in the next video. Please subscribe.